YouTube. It is Saturday, April 11th, and this is the 11th day of beta. Oh my god, I can't believe I made this far. Um, my major problem with making vlogs, especially for beta, is that a lot of the time I sit down and make up a plan of what I'm going to talk about, and then something happens to piss me off or get me really excited about something completely different, and then I can't concentrate on what I was going to talk about. Um, usually in the case of me just making a vlog, I would just wait for the next day, hopefully have chilled out by then, and then make the vlog, but because this is beta, I have to make a vlog every day. So, what I wanted to talk about was I was going through some of my comments on my videos, especially the one where I promised Jesse Cat 12 the, um, shirt, uh, not the shirt, the, uh, the, the scarf. And Michael's Productions said that's not fair. And Michael's Productions is a channel that is used to be OXL, I think. Um, and I really, really, he was one of my you know best commenters. And I have a lot of really great commenters. Um, David Braces, while I had Braces, I haven't heard from him since. Um, I have, I had Momiji. I had um, OXL, which is now Michael's Productions. And I had a lot of other people who commented you know, barely a lot. But the thing is, I can't, I can't very well, like, be like, oh my god, you are my best subscriber, so you get a present. And I can't very well be like, oh, well, you did the most comments, so you get a present. Because the thing is, there's probably some person who's flamed me a bunch of times before I blocked them that technically made more posts than other people, but I don't know. And I just, I felt like I wanted to do something for my 100th subscriber. It doesn't make them better no offense Jesse you're awesome but it doesn't make them better than my other subscribers it's just you know it's like when you go to a restaurant and you walk in they're like oh, ding, 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 ding. oh my god you're a one millionth customer it doesn't make you better than the other customers it just means you hit the magic number it's luck not skill that gets you the prize in some situations and I'm sure that this is teaching people a bad lesson about, you know, getting stuff for free and all this stuff. But I mean, sometimes things happen to you and they're good and they're pleasant and they're lucky. And because of that, other people feel a little bit upset because, hey, the good thing didn't happen to me. But, you know, you can't always win the giant teddy bear at the ring toss. You sometimes just have to, you know, accept the tiny little, well, you try it three times, have a two inch long monkey thing so um yeah it's easter tomorrow which means candy which makes me happy because i like candy and i like we have this thing um at my church where we have a uh, sunrise service and we do a little short service take it easy in the parking lot um, at sunrise and we watch the sun rise up and we sing hymns and everything and then we all go over to the fire hall and have breakfast with bacon yeah great way to bring in Easter by having the bacon <laughs> because hey Jesus bacon it makes sense in a really weird blasphemous kind of way but yeah um, it's just it amuses me a lot that on Shrove Tuesday, we have pancakes, and then on Easter morning, we have this huge, like, breakfast with eggs and, um, toast and bacon, because it's like, we start with breakfast food, we end with breakfast food, woo, London season! Uh, <laughs> but yeah, um, the thing is, I am planning on doing something really huge for all of my subscribers. Um, it actually, I was thinking about having a little contest. But I'm thinking I might have to change that because Michael's Productions got really mad at me for giving Jesse a present. And I don't want to make anyone mad at me. So I don't know what to do now. You guys have suggestions of what I can do for my awesome subscribers who subscribe to me and are awesome? Um, I will take them. But yeah, I did have a little contest that I was planning on doing. But um, yeah, I mean, limited it to people who would make videos. But it was still kind of a fun idea that I had, like, subscribers only. And I would double check my subscribers list. But, uh, yeah. And it could only be the original 100, which I'm probably going to make a list of, um, if I decide to do the contest. Be like, this person, this person, this person. And I'd have all these rules. But, unfortunately, 
I don't want to, like, get anyone else angry at me because I like having my subscribers. I really appreciate you guys. So, um, I'm going to go off now and I'm going to go pick up the yarn for Jesse's gift. And, um, yeah. So, I guess this kind of means that I can't do things for my 250th and 500th and 1,000th subscriber because, obviously, I don't want to, like, offend anyone anymore. I don't know what to do. So anyways, yes, I'm going off. I'm going to the mall. That is my plan. Hopefully I am not stopped. My family has been a bit odd about me leaving the house, which I guess I'm only home for a few days, so they want me to stick around. But really, dude, I can't just stay in the house. That's wrong. Anyways, bye. Well, I am just a Tuesday in a world of Friday nights. And I get choked up on the foreground. No, I never get it right Oh, not with one foot on the fence Not with both to one side Where's your memory when you've made up?